Hi Gemini, this is Sandy Couture and I am here doing the astrological tarot reading for the sign of Gemini for the month of July 2022. Hard to believe that July is um, upon us. I apologize for this video being late, but I have been pretty busy in the last couple of weeks speaking with people who have had um, old wounds, old emotional things, old um, situations, old people, old friends, old lovers, surf, surfacing, sifting to the surface of their psyche because that is exactly what's happening to all of us. Um, and the message in that that is that it is time for us to take a look at those things honestly. Whatever you stuff down is gonna be coming to the surface especially if you're ready to look at it. So whatever comes up, know that this is what's supposed to come up. Take a look at it honestly. Understand that whatever the, whatever reason you put it aside, it can no longer hurt you or bother you. It's just time for you to let it go and move through. It's going to be a huge soul growth movement. Um, the next two weeks are going to be, that is where you need to be, is in that process of sitting, sitting with, whatever is coming up for you. Um, after the 20th of July, it'll be time to move forward again. So keep that in mind. The first card that I pulled for you, Gemini, is the um, Ace of Swords. Now, aces are always gifts from God, and the sword card is about uh, ideas and intellect. So there's going to be a brilliant new concept or intellect coming to you or presented to you this month, Gemini. So keep your eyes open for it. Um, it's going to be something I believe that will benefit you. And your surprise or challenge card is the three of um, pentacles. Now, pentacles are about uh, material well-being, but this card is about knowing that, okay, if somebody presents you with a, a great new idea, know that you have whatever it takes to carry forward in that. Don't doubt your um, confidence. Go grab a hold of this idea with all the confidence in the world because you have it within you to be successful at whatever that situation is. Your process card is gonna be a little more of a challenge for you, Gemini. Once again, a swords card. Uh, Gemini is an air sign, swords card, is a an air card but this one is a you see that the three swords are pointing at his heart and gut the one sword is laying beneath this means that you need to get a hold of your feelings and get in touch with your feelings it's meditation time get in there deep see how you feel about things not just what you think about things. And the last card is another sword card. And this one doesn't look good. It's the 10 of swords. But the truth is, it's about allowing yourself to let go. The golden light is coming down through these swords and permeating this person who is lying on the ground, permeating their whole being. It's about surrender. You don't need to push. You don't need to barrel in. Surrender to what's being presented to you, surrender to your opportunities and move forward with them. So hopefully that was good for all you Geminis out there and I will be back at the end of August or the end of July. Um, if any of you have any personal questions about your personal astrology or would like a private tarot reading, just drop me a note and I will get back with you. I hope you're having a wonderful 4th of July and a wonderful July and um, take care. Bye now.